Saludos amigos de Prevención, nos encontramos en la ciudad de Nueva York, en el Madison Square Garden, en el Tiller, donde este día se lleva a cabo la conferencia de prensa entre lo que será la pelea del Canelo Álvarez y Triple G, a celebrarse el 16 de septiembre de este año 2017. Vamos a ver lo que dijeron los fugilistas y lo que opinaron sus entrenadores acerca de esta gran pelea. Hoya up here with us, the legend Bernard Hopkins, and of course the two guys that are responsible for having all these fans here today. We have a silver medalist who has destroyed everyone that has been placed in front of him. He's the current WBC, WBA, IBF champion. He has a record of 37-0 and 0 with 33 of those wins coming by way of knockout. Put your hands together for Gennady Triple G Golovkin. My right, we have the current lineal and ring magazine middleweight champion. He has been boxing since the age of 15. Tenemos aquí el orgullo de México, Saúl Canelo Alvarez. Whenever you have a middleweight fight with two of the best middleweights in the world today, you're going to get action. You're going to get a great fight. It's a guaranteed knockout fight. Um, history shows it. You go back to Sugar Ray Robinson, you go back to uh, Roberto Duran and Thomas Hearns, you go back to my partner Bernard Hopkins. These are the best middleweights in the world from the past, the present, and the future. And the future is here right now with Golovkin and Canelo on September uh, 6th. With such an exciting style like Triple G, like Canelo Alvarez, they don't know how to go backwards. They come forward, they both fight in the Mexican style, they're going to put on a great show for the fans. So I think that's what the fans are looking forward to, is the best, fighting the best, and that's what you have September 16th. Yeah, Oscar, what do you think it is about these guys that the fans just love? Vamos a contestar en español. A ver. Yo creo que lo, lo más importante es de que... Lo más importante es la afición. La afición porque, obviamente, la afición sabe que esta pelea es una pelea... Eh, una pelea bien seria, una pelea peligrosa para ambos. Eh, pero yo creo que lo más importante es que cada, cada uno tiene sus fans. Eh, eh, Triple G ha demostrado eh, año por año eh, de que él es uno de los mejores pesos medianos eh, en el mundo hoy en día. Y el Canelo Álvarez, pues, él es el ídolo mexicano, el, el, el la esperanza de México. Y obviamente tiene sus fans por todo el mundo. Y uh, eh, dentro del cuadrilátero, dentro del cuadrilátero, lo que la gente espera es una explosión y va a ser una pelea, una pelea bien entretenida. Now this fight, this is the perfect time for boxing, but why is it right now the perfect time for you to fight Gennady? No, yo creo que... Para enfrentarlo a él y a cualquiera, creo que estoy en un momento de mi carrera, el momento, uno de los momentos más importantes en mi carrera. Sé que puedo dar más todavía, no, pero estoy en mi mejor momento. Creo que la pelea llegó en un buen momento para el boxeo. Pero creo que el boxeo necesitaba esta pelea. La gente, la gente pedía esta pelea y simplemente quise darles lo que la gente pide. You told me that it has been three years since you wanted this fight. In that time that it took to make this fight, has it made it hungrier? Has it made you hungrier for this fight to fight against Canelo? Yeah, first of all, good evening, everybody. Thank you people who support us and our true boxing fans. And of course everybody very excited for this fight. Uh, yeah, last couple of years everybody want to watch this fight. Right now everybody ready. Yeah, I'm very hungry and I believe now if you see is very hungry too. It's a very interesting fight for us. Thank you. We're still three months away. We still got so much time and the fans are so hungry. So you guys why is this fight causing such an uproar, causing such a stir within the fans? Because this is, this is the best against the best. Yes. 
And you have, you have two knockout artists who will try to take their head off on September 16th. And there's nothing better than watching two great fighters inside that same ring. At their prime, one is undefeated, the other one is great, both are great. Um, we're, we're in for a special treat on September 16th and uh, Bernard can't wait, one of the best middleweight fighters in, in, in the history of this sport. You have all uh, world champions from past and present talking about this real fight that is taking place on September 16th. Why are people so crazy about this fight? What can we expect come September 16th from everyone? I'm going to keep it real simple. Somebody will get knocked up out. <laughs> Period. And you know, might be a second one, but let's get past this one. But it's going to be a fight that people are going to talk about, I'm pretty sure. The way Triple G come, he's a, he's a champion, he's a, he's a confident champion, and Canelo's the same way. So when you got two types of mentalities, it's, it's a hard fight to not want to watch. Canelo's fans, my fans, is more boxing fans, because this is a big gift, big present to boxing, this sport. We're both great athletes, professional athletes, you know, special for you guys. This is, September 16th is a, is a real fight against two real fighters, against two real boxers. It doesn't get any better than this. You have two fighters who are in their prime. You have two fighters who know and have lived and breathed the sport of boxing. And you have a unification. You have two knockout artists. You have guys who are, who are uh, at the top of their game. This is a real fight on September 16th. And most importantly, it's on the date of September 16th, which is Mexican Independence Holiday, which is the biggest holiday for the sport of boxing. Anybody in their right mind would love to fight on September 16th. And guess what? Canelo and Triple G are taking over September 16th. Yo creo que, yo también creo y pienso que puedo. Creo que en el boxeo no se puede predecir un knockout, ¿no? Pero me voy a preparar al 100%. Creo que esta pelea por los estilos de los dos es seguramente no va a terminar los 12 asaltos. Entonces hay que estar listos para cualquier cosa. Es lo mismo, ¿no? Como en todas. Va a ser, va a ser muy importante y, y vamos a trabajar en todo. Y... Bueno, es una grande posibilidad ¿no? del knockout por los estilos y creo que, como lo dije, esa pelea no va a terminar a decisión y me voy a preparar para, para ser yo el que lo aplique. Y bueno, muy emotiva ha sido la conferencia de prensa aquí en el Madison Square Garden en la ciudad de Nueva York donde eh, Oscar de la Hoya habló y también habló Triple G, así como también el Canelo Álvarez acerca de cómo será la pelea de el 16 de septiembre de este año del 2017, Oscar de la Hoya dijo que será como eh, la cereza en el pastel para este año, hablando boxísticamente, ya que será una pelea que tenga mucha expectativa y que pues esperan que gane el mejor de ellos. Con imágenes de Uriel Bello y de Manuel Mendieta, informó para Verea Visión desde Nueva York, Square, eh, del Madison Square Garden, Levi Morales.